Hey guys, this is Armageddon X430. I just want to let you guys know why I haven't been uploading again, why I might have been delayed. I had the status on my website, which I should have up most of the time. Um, I guess some of the silver putty on my CPU, between my CPU and my heat sink, uh, decided to melt away, or I don't know what, why it did it, but uh, some of it came off. And so the standard running temperature for my computer was 60 degrees C Celsius. Um, and when I started trying to render footage, I was I shut off the rendering at 110 degrees C. So I never was able to render footage once this problem had occurred. So I went online. I'll put a link in the description of what it is. It's um, some sort of Arctic cooling system. It's got both a uh, latent system and a uh, non-parallel uh, heat sink and fan. It's very interesting. It's very large, but it just fits in there barely. <laughs> and um, once I got it, instead of having 60 degrees C standard running temperature, I had 33 degrees standard running temperature. Slightly Slight improvement there. And then the rendering, instead of 110, it got a little bit better. It got oh, 46. 46 is a little bit better than 110. So I recommend if anybody has any heating issues with their computer, um, also I would check out uh, CPU, uh, wait, sorry, SpeedFan. SpeedFan is free software that can tell you what all the temperatures are on your computer and how fast your fans are moving. It doesn't actually let you change anything, but it gives you information on how that all works. Um, so it also can give you a warning if it gets too hot. So I, if you have standard running temperature above 45 or 50, I would recommend uh, getting a new heat sink uh, and a fan. It only costs like 30 or 40 bucks. Um, so there you go, and I'll talk to you guys another time. Bye!